guys. So um, I'm just going to be sharing a few things with you. I got my first Ipsy on Christmas Eve and I want to share the products that came in it and basically like a short review on all the items in there. And then also just a few things that I've gotten over the last few days from like after Christmas and with all the sales and everything. Um, I got a, quite a few nice things and so I'd like to share those with you as well. So if you're interested then go ahead and just keep watching my video and tell me what you think. Okay, so for the Ipsy bag, it comes in a bag that just is black like this and um, just has this little heart on it that says Ipsy. Um, it was a little smaller than what I had pictured. Um, I imagine something a tad bit bigger. Um, but yeah, that's okay. It's just a bag. I'll probably never use it or maybe I'll give it away someday as a gift or something. <clears throat> um, I'll start with the makeup brush. I got a double-ended makeup brush for creasing and blending. And... Um, it doesn't, oh, it's by Crown Brush. I don't know if they're really expensive or not, um, but I do really love them. Um, so far since I've used it, I have not used this side, only the, the like blending side, but it seems to work very nicely. Um, I also got this Cool Way. It's for your hair. It's to repair um, your split ends, and it also helps with frizz, and I've actually noticed that. Um, but yeah, I haven't really noticed my split ends. I've only been using it for like a few days, but actually, usually they're a lot, they're not as tame. Like usually they're kind of fraying out more. So maybe it has been helping. Um, I really wish this was a little bit bigger. It came really small. I know that they only give you like sample sizes of stuff, but I mean, this is already almost gone and I've only used it for like two or three days now. And, um, yeah, you just leave it in your hair for four minutes and then... You let it um, sit, and then after that, you wash it out. It doesn't say to use conditioner afterwards. It only says to use shampoo before and then this, but I'm going to use conditioner because that's what smooths my hair. Um, so I do that afterwards, and it doesn't seem to make a difference. Um, the next thing I got was this um, Pixie eyeshadow in the color, uh, I think it's Brightening Bear. So it's like a very light um, color. And it's bizarre, oh my gosh, it comes like a powder, and let me show you. Yeah, it's really, it's really bizarre. Um, but yeah, I like it a lot so far, and it's a really pretty, just like nude color. Um, the next thing I got was this Tarte Light Camera Act or uh, Lashes um, uh, Mascara, and it's actually really nice. I was expecting this to be a little bit bigger too, but it... I know it's going to go by fast, so I want to save up and get one. But the brush just looks like this. You can see that. Um, I'm wearing it right now. And my eyelashes look absolutely beautiful. Um, and then I mixed it. I used the telescop, uh, Telescopic Shocking Extensions Mascara first. And then I used this one last. And it seems to make my eyelashes just gorgeous. And I was actually considering getting false lashes until I got this, and it works amazing. So I changed my mind completely just by using this. I'm telling you, it's awesome. I don't know how much it is in stores or anything like that. Um, but, I mean, I've heard that it's really expensive, which it probably is. It's tart. But, um, yeah, I really like that. And the last thing I got in my Ipsy bag was the NYX uh, Butter Lip Balm in the color Red Velvet. And um, it's pretty, so I have a dog hair on my nose, and it's like, oh, I think I just got it. Maybe not. Anyway. Um, and it's really pretty. It's tinted for sure. Show you here. You can see that, but it's really pretty, and I love it. Um, it's, it looks more like pink than red, but that's okay. I still like it anyway. Um, and now I'm going to move on to some clothing items that I got and show you those as well. So in Northtown Mall, our Aeropostale is clothing, clothing, closing um, because it's moving all the way to the Valley, to the Valley one and they're making it um, a bigger store, I guess. And so they're just having a big closeout sale and everything must go and it's like 30 to 70% off of all their stuff. So I got these really, really cute slippers. And there's dog hair already like all over them. But I realized that I need some because I wake up in the morning and I'm cold and my feet are like clammy. And um, I'd rather just walk around in these than get dog hair stuck to my feet. 
um, or socks. So I got these and they were only $12 and they, I don't even remember the original price. I think they were like 20 some. So, or maybe 30 some, I don't know. They were expensive though. So I was really lucky to have gotten these. Um, what else I got from Aeropostale was just this cute dash hound shirt. So it has a little wiener doggy on it. If the sleeve's not all messed up, that'd be awesome. So I got it in medium because I like the oversized clothing. And okay, Bethany Moda stuff never, ever goes on sale there. But because they have to close out, then all their, her stuff is on sale. Um, so these were, this is Bethany Moda's shirt. And oh my god, it's so cute. It's a little bit longer in the back. And it goes pretty far down on me. So that's what I like because I like to do it with like skinny jeans or leggings. Um, let's see. I got this, and that that shirt was only like seven bucks or something. Um, the next thing I got was this Aeropostale jacket for seven ninety nine, just a little um, zip up hoodie, and it just says Aeropostale on it. And this was their last color, and it happened to be in my size, small, and so it was really really cute. And I'm so fortunate that I got the last one because it was like the blues and pinks, but. I like to wear like solid colors like a white or a black or a gray because they can be matched with like any type of color of like shoe or jewelry or like things like that. Um, so that's why I got that color. And then I also got, let me try to stand up so I can show you, this um, white shirt. Um, they sadly only had mediums left, but then once I tried it on I was like, okay, well that makes sense because it actually looks really good in a bigger size. Um, but yeah, it's just white and it's got like the hood in the back. Sadly, I won't be able to wear it at work or anything, so only like weekends, but that's okay. Um, the next clothing, clothing item I got was not from Aeropostale. It was from Maurice's. And it's just this dress and it's the, you know, high-low dresses. And they had it on sale for 75% off. And this dress is originally 40 there's like a markdown tag on it. I don't know. Oh, 44 something. And then it looks like it got marked down to 40.98. And then um, I got it for 10 bucks. So it was like nine something. So I really looked out and I cannot wait till spring or summer to wear this. This will probably be my Easter dress this year. Or, oh my gosh, next year? Weird. But yeah, so um, yeah, I love it though. It's beautiful colors. Um, I think now I will move on to showing you some lip glosses that I got and things like that. Um, and I actually got another pair of shoes. I will show you them. Um, these were actually something I did get for Christmas. And they are my black Toms. My boyfriend got them for me. Um, I've been wanting black and he had, he just luckily knew, like, there was... I didn't want the white sole bottoms because they then they get all grimy and dirty and then it's like if they're gonna be black anyway why not just get them black so I did and um, I love them in just all black um, but yeah so my boyfriend got me these for Christmas and they are so comfortable I've worn them almost every day so far okay, so I did get some um, lip products um, my sister got me a NYX, oh, not NYX Ulta gift card so I went there um, I got this EOS chapstick not too long ago um, I already have one but I decided to get another one. Oh, I forget what one it is it's like strawberry or maybe like mixed berry or something but it smells awesome I put this on when I'm doing my makeup I put it on my lips to moisturize um, and all that good stuff um, oh by the way these earrings my mom got me for Christmas and it came with a matching necklace as well um, but I always just wear my key necklace that my boyfriend got me on our two years. So I usually just mainly wear that anyway. Um, I got like all these butter lipsticks and one butter gloss. And I only had to pay like 12 bucks. Um, there was a package of three. I believe it was these three. Yes. Okay. So these three came in a package together, these butter lipsticks. 
only six bucks, like five ninety seven or something like that. I was like, oh my gosh. And a lady before that had told me ten, so I got really happy. Um, this one is in the color taffy, and I, I will swatch all of these for you. So this one's in the color taffy. And then, so if you can see that, just a pink, very, very pink. Um, and then this one is in the color Snowcap. So this one is basically just a brownish nude color. That one's really pretty. And then this one is in Candy Buttons. And this one's like a peach. So, oh my gosh, they look really similar. But this is more pink and that's definitely brown. Um, and then I got, I'll share the butter gloss last. Um, I got the, in Hubba Bubba, I got a pink one. Well, you're not even going to be able to see this one. Maybe you won't even be able to see it. It's such a light pink. Oh my god, it's pretty. But I don't think you'll be able, oh, you can kind of like barely, barely, barely see it. I don't know. It's really light though. Um... This is like the color though, I guess. Looks nude, but it's not. And then I got cotton candy. Maybe you'll be able to see this one. I'm hoping. Oh, barely also. So this one's just like a little bit more pink than the last one. And then um, I decided to try a matte lipstick. And I got it in the color spirit and this one is um also it's like a nudish looks kind of orange but it's that one but it's pretty though and then the um butter gloss i got was in creme brulee and i absolutely love it oh i will put it on right now and y'all can see Mm -mm. It is so, it's just like, it's very lightly tinted pink, but, oh my gosh, it is so pretty. Okay. See, you can tell it's like very lightly, lightly tinted. Oh my gosh, it is gorgeous. I love it. Um, Gross. Okay. Anyway, so those were just like a few things that I had gotten um, this, you know, post Christmas or whatever you call it. Um, I love the new stuff that I got um, and I love all the presents that I got for my family this year and my boyfriend and stuff. So I'm very thankful for all of that. Um, I hope you guys all had a really good Christmas and everything and I cannot wait for New Year's. Um, it's going to be tons and tons of fun. I don't think I have anything else that I got that was new that I could show you. I'm trying to think because there's always that one thing that I forget. I don't think so. I think this is all. Maybe. But yeah, Um. so I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas and I hope you guys have a wonderful New Year's as well and um just go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you'd like to see more of this kind of stuff i'm thinking i might do an updated skincare routine because it's completely different than what it used to be um so i think i'm going to do a different skincare routine and um yeah i haven't really changed my makeup routine too much just a little so maybe i'll do that but yeah if you guys would like to see any of those go ahead and give it a thumbs up and thumbs up also for a wonderful new year. I will see you guys probably next year. Bye-bye.